and this is where the pipes are going. We've got another two full courses, then the pipes going to start. So we need to uh, cut back some of these devil branches. All right, I better stop rambling now. I'll, uh, we'll, yeah. <laughs> Don't you see that line there? I can't see myself on the camera. So after today, we've run out of blocks. So I get Father's Day off. Good morning, back on the uh, giant shed slash workshop slash living space. Uh, as you can see, we're uh, what are we doing, Dad? Pruning. Pruning. And we've been, we've been infected by the curse of the new materials. Yeah, we're a bit uh, we're dry on stuff at the moment. So, um, and this is where the pegs are going. We've got another two full courses then the pipe's going to start so we need to uh, cut back some of these devil branches it's becoming a trend now isn't it cutting these conifers, the case of the conifers yeah but that's uh, that's the goal today lintels have arrived so we can get the uh, windows and doors done waiting for trestles waiting for trestles yes yeah, so and then we can get our pike in and then whatever else we can get blasted out today maybe let me start one of the sides, but uh, yeah, we're uh, waiting on, the commons have arrived, we're just waiting on more block, and uh, and the trestles like Dad said. Alright, I'd better stop rambling now, I'll, uh, we'll, yeah. Will the um, will the Makita saw not be good for this? No. Too, you need two hands for it. No, that's it's true. Yeah. Right, watch out. Beautiful. Right, it's um, pulling up for half nine. Still waiting for these trestles. We can't really start without them. We can build that end up, but if we build that end, we just, we've just got to bring everything through there. Which is just making it difficult for ourselves. Nice big doors, but it's tight yet. Quarter to ten. Quarter to ten. So, as you can see, trestles have arrived. This side's up, and we've got plenty, so we're just going to put this return on. And we can run that section in there as well while we're at it. But we have enough to do the back and the side up to the expansion, because we're doing it in sections, so we've broke it down into six sections. So we're not going to quite going to reach the top of there, so we're going to have to put a hop up at the top for the next couple of blocks. But, um, while we're waiting we've set the timber up with the markings on it and the top of the pike on it and that's uh yeah Alex can't reach it's up in the tree the, the nail way up there might just be able to see it on the camera actually but that's it that's our pike set out so we're just finishing off setting the trestles up grab the coffee and then I'll get a mix in and now it's going to start loading up Right, get a brick and reach leg out. 
struggle. Oh, There we go, sorted. <coughs> so we've got, see that, don't you see that line there? I can't see myself on the camera. <coughs> yeah, he was wreaking havoc today. Yeah, anyway, we've got um, two coarser block, coarser commons, which takes us to Lintel Height, which is 2100. But um, we're slightly higher because we're, we're doing these Imperial. So 9, 18, 27, 36, which lifts our gauge up slightly. <coughs> which means we'll have a, a bit of a split underneath the door just to raise the door off the concrete. But at this end, it'll be a, yeah, same as, a bit of a split. So with the split on the door threshold, it'll give them about 60, 70 mil to put a floor down inside this area. They're not bothering this side, this is just like a storeroom come shed cupboard. So that's the plan. And as I'll ex explained before, we've got we've got enough block next to the van there. Got 54 there and about 20 odd spread, spread around to get that done. We've got the side loaded, but we don't want to build that because we don't want to block our way in. That's last. Um, and yeah that's it so after today we've run out of blocks so I get Father's Day off um, yeah that's it we don't want to take those blocks from there because they're already loaded so we should have enough with these we can pinch these get this boxed off today round to there and then wrap that back a bit for the lintel Uh, yeah, that's it. So we'll go and finish our break. I'll get my coffee and get back at it.
And that's nine. So course of brick and my lintel and then we can start thinking about um, more plates and pikes. And there's our top of our pike. So quick dinner now and then get this pike up today and then perhaps set the uh, scaffold up for the next section. says only you did that. No, I didn't do that. You show me it. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. Just start jointing. No. Just do it neat. On the pillars. Right, got our commons on. We've got no commons going on these pikes. No need. No, no need. So this is going on now. I've marked the 150 on 1200 opening, 1500 concrete lintel. So let's get it up. Is it good? I'm good. Uh, do I have a marking? Yeah. Uh... Right. Yeah. Good. You grab that, let's gauge it and level it. Just um, grab hold of your end and just like hold it so it doesn't sink. Mine is going down. Right. Yeah. Real quick. I need to stop it. Okay, back to the normal services regime. Okay, now you can let go, eh? There you go, nice close up of the bubble. YouTube style. Cool. Just do it slow motion, then you do, you do, you do a bubble white like that. Shit out. <laughs> okay. Don't mind doing that because the lintel's all shaped. Right, let's get this lamp now and get the rest of this block work on So there's nothing to go in here? Pillars are finished now. Wall's finished. There's just um, commons over the top. No, there's not. Wall plate goes over the top. Is it commons next to it? To next to it, yeah. But the wall plate sits on top. Yeah. Yeah. So if we get this line up. Line well, can come down here, can't it? Yeah. Bless you. Okay. Where's that mate? Nine inch. Nine inch. Don't forget that 
Thank you. So this will come off. Extra hand. Done. Right, let's get this in. Get this course on and we can set up a tight line now. Right, we're getting towards the top of the pipe now. Profile's run out, we're above the profile. So here is another way to use a fixed brick. Obviously I can't get the line any higher. Get into the two grooves, lift it up. Let me do that again, put with one with both hands. Here you can still see. There you go. Because of the two grooves at the top, it lifts the line up. So, there you go. The line's above the profile now, but the fit brick's holding it up in place. And I can just run these last couple of blocking. Great. I think I'll put you up here now. Al? You got the other one? Please. Uh, where is it? Hey? Where is it? Could be anywhere. Could be one of the profile buckets, could be in the yellow bucket.
beast seems a bit upset with me. Oh, sorry? This beast seems a bit upset with me. Quite likes me. I think it's a big flower. Yeah. Um, where the hell is it? That's it. Once you've done my cuts, everything else can go away then. What'd you say? Get ready to do these cuts, but get everything as much as you can put away. Like, all oh, that should be in the van now. I can't put anything in the van yet. Why? The mixer needs to go in first. The bucket can go in the back, in the van. Everything can go in the van. Mixer not holding anything. It is, because the back of the van's where you pack. Well, just right, watch out, there's a wasp after you now. We're just going to pile the back up. So I mean the back is piled up. Can just organise it a bit Yeah, well, just two cuts, so I can see these two. Oh, sorry? There's just two cuts to do now.
tell you what, you need more than 18. Grinder done with now? Uh, yeah. What was that? Are you on a rampage against all the tools today? I don't know if I've heard. Do you remember if I booked tickets for Blackpool or not? Yeah. I did book them? Yeah. You sure? Yeah, can I book them? Hey? Because I'm the one who did it. Oh, you've got the email Is everything away? Um, more or less, just the stuff that you haven't done with, like the profile bucket, the profiles. All that's done with. Except. All the profile stuff's done with. Alright. Wow, that was a tough build. That's getting trimmed off tomorrow. Doesn't look much, but that's hard work, that. You need to hop up on top of the trestles to get the top. 25 courses, but so many cuts. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 5 courses, but 14 cuts because of the, the shallow pitch. So I just need to get over now and try and join the, uh, the outside. So we'll have a quick recap when we're done.